Listen to this. If you had to transcribe me saying the phrase African American novels or African American fiction, would you use a hyphen between African and American? Chances are most contemporary listeners would not include a hyphen. Over the decades, because of societal habits and in large part based on direction from newspaper style guides like the Associated Press Style Book and the New York Times Manual of Style and Usage, we have reduced our use of a hyphen between African and American when we write African American literature, African American novels, and African American fiction. The diminished presence of the hyphen seems minor, but it does carry implications. Hyphenated African American can suggest the merging of African American cultural and historical identities. Some say with disdain that the hyphen indicates a kind of partial belonging to Americanness, suggesting that they are hyphenated Americans. Unhyphenated African American has come to signal a distinct identity while avoiding that troubling connotation of partial belonging.